Hello everyone, it's the weekend all jump aficionados have been waiting for, the return of National Hunt action at Cheltenham. But for those interested on the flat, don't despair. Still got some good cards from Newbury where the Horace Hill and St Simon take centre stage. All in all, a weekend for everyone. The card at Newbury on Saturday is headlined by the Virgin Bet Horace Hill stakes run over seven furlongs. Plenty of unexposed two-year-olds line up. Godolphin's striking star is one from one. However, Roger Teal's Caraggio, a son of star sprinter Caravaggio, could take all the beating. He beat another Godolphin horse, Highbank, last time out at Leicester. Caraggio's got a break on him, and he leads by a couple of lengths. He's not stopping either Caraggio, and Highbank's got nothing left. It will be Caraggio for Roger Teal, and Adam Kirby who wins in good style. Race three is the Virgin Bet St Simon Stakes, a group three over a mile and a half. William Haggis won this race last year with Illarab, and here he saddled a short-priced favourite, Hamish. The talented six-year-old has two Group 3 victories this season and was only narrowly beaten by Kiprios in the Irish St Ledger. But in the lead is Kiprios from Hamish. There's a length and a half between them as they run up towards the final 100 yards. Kiprios in the right on conquering stairs. The only three-year-old in the lineup is Grand Alliance for Charlie Fellows. He has been a frustrating horse to follow this season, but his trainer has always held him in high regard. We've got a really nice horse on our hands. He's a funny horse. I genuinely, I'd love to say I've always known he's a star, but he has shown, he shows next to nothing at home, but just is a completely different horse on the racetrack. Cheltenham is back, and their Saturday card sees two old adversaries clash in the Masterson Holdings hurdle. Hyde Piper and Knight salute Lockhorns again after their race at Aintree ended in a controversial dead heat. Pied Piper runs down it, gets over a length clear from Knight Salute staking his claim. These two have dashed away. Knight Salute pressing hard. Pied Piper and Knight Salute in a flared nostril finish. The most valuable race on the card is race four, the 888 Sport Handicap Chase over two miles. Clear the runways on a five race winning streak for the Inform Laura Morgan team. Although the top weight editor Dujit loves the track and has form figures of 1, 1 and 4 at Cheltenham. Irish dominance has been a theme at Cheltenham in recent years and they are strongly represented in the three mile novice chase at 4.25. Marla Mission represents John McConnell who makes his chase debut. Was life in the park in the colours of 2021 Gold Cup winner Manella Indo already has a chase win to his name. The final fence, life in the park, over from perfect attitude, life in the park is giving a moving account, first time over a fence. So as the flat action dies down, the jumping really takes hold and next week, remember, we have the Charlie Hall from Weatherby, one of the big early season targets for potential Gold Cup horses.